is Charlotte, and I work here at Science World. And today I'm going to be showing you some really cool demos you can do with bubbles. One of the best parts about bubbles is they're really easy to, uh, to do at home, really simple to make. So our ingredients for making our bubble solution are one part water and one part soap with a little bit of glycerin, which helps our bubbles last a little longer. So as you can see, there's a thin bubble film that makes up our bubble, and the film itself is actually sort of a soap and water sandwich. So our two ingredients work together. The outside layer is a layer of soap, then a very thin layer of water in between, and then soap again on the inside. So that's what makes up our bubble. And bubbles are really fun. You can use them to make all sorts of cool structures, cool sculptures. Okay, so we're gonna try these a few bubble tricks. The first one is the caterpillar. So we're gonna start with a small bubble on our wand and we're gonna see how many small bubbles we can attach to make a vertical column. So we've got two, three, four, five, six, oh, looking pretty good, seven, oh, and it quit. So seven's the number to beat. I've seen them up to 10 bubbles long, so see if you can beat our record. So another favorite here at Science World is our bubble carousel. So we need two medium-sized bubbles. And where the two bubbles meet, we're gonna add a bunch of little small bubbles, a lot of little seats for our carousel. Awesome. And there's a little breeze, and our carousel spins. One final trick I'm gonna show you, which is one of my favorites, is the cube-shaped bubble. So not a bubble you see very often, sort of defies physics a little bit. So we're gonna start it in a similar fashion to our bubble carousel with two medium-sized bubbles. There we go, so one medium-sized bubble, two medium-sized bubbles, and then we're gonna put, make another carousel, but with only four seats of about the same size. Four. So now you're gonna see there's one point where all the bubbles sort of meet and your six bubbles there, you're gonna sort of put your straw right in the middle and blow at that point and now you see we have a cube shaped bubble in the middle. Pretty cool. So I've shown you some pretty cool tricks, all on the small scale though. My next demonstration, I'm gonna grab a volunteer and actually use a big bubble, put a person inside a bubble. So let's see how big of a bubble we can make. Now that we've got it all set up, we're gonna be putting a person into a bubble. So I'm gonna call on one of my good friends, Ailish here. Hey Charlotte. Hey, would you like to step onto the stool here? And we're gonna put you inside a bubble. Uh, we're using a kiddie pool and a hula hoop as our bubble wand to make a bubble so large. So we need to make sure our hula hoop has lots of bubble solution on it. Okay, here we go. Up, 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 and over Ailish's head. Awesome! So feel free to try all these bubble demos at home. All the information you need is on our Science World Resources website.